and we're back in the bathroom again because I didn't get rid of the orange. Okay, so we're gonna use this espresso color to cover up these roots. Now you know I have epic fails almost every time and um, I actually filmed a video recently and it just turned on my hair like this, which is pretty much exactly how it started. So I didn't even put that video up. This one, I'm hoping for brown. Now I'm thinking I'm gonna end up looking like I need to have my roots done. <laughs> but, uh, you know, and touch up my highlights. But um, right now I can deal with that better than this because I really, I really hate this orange. Um, and I'm not ready to give up and go to the hairdresser yet. So that's like June, I think I'm just gonna go for a real hair like. So at this point, if I can get this to look better than it does, I mean, hell, I walked around since like January like this, I can do it again, right? So here we go. Uh, to do this, you take this bottle, open it up, pour this junk in and pour this junk in. And obviously I'm not gonna use it all. I'm just gonna do like the underneath and a little tiny bit on the top, but you gotta make it all and so I guess if in an hour when I wash it out, dry it and look at it, I hate it, we'll just do all over brown and I'll be brown, no longer blonde. Um, I'll be right back when I'm getting started or to show you after. See you soon. So I have one in three in a bottle too and we'll shake it up. And now I'm just trying to decide what to do. I think I like the brush method the best. So I guess I'm going to shake this all up and then put it in my trusty cup and brush it on. Um, I don't know if you remember, if you've watched my other video where I decided like I wanted this under stuff to be red, but I don't. I actually don't want this under stuff to be red. I want this under stuff to be brown. So first things first, we're just going to paint that back brown. Oh, using your hands is a good helpful tool because you can tell if it's wet even with the glove on. All right. So that was one of the areas that's really been bothering me it is covered. Now I'm going to let some of this hair down and see what to do with next. So what do I do? I'm thinking I'm going to comb through it now because this is darker and this is lighter. We're just comb partially. Let's wait for like a couple minutes. And then we'll put more hair down that way. Who knows what we're doing? It's all gonna end up brown anyway, because we're just gonna, in the end, decide that it all needs to go be made brown. Okay, I'm back. I think it's been 10 minutes, maybe 15. I got caught up reading comments on some of my videos and um, I don't even know if I should adjust this here, but oh shit, what's that? <laughs> Color on my face. Anyway, um, you know, I make a lot of videos about Lime Light by Alcon products and that's because I considered selling it. And I mean, I swear, fucking A, I swear. And I'm not gonna get monetized. I don't make them for views. I make them because I enjoy making them and I actually hope to help people. And these kind of videos, like the hair ones, I find them entertaining. I like watching other people screw up their hair. So that's why I make them for you. I don't care if you watch. I mean, I love subscribers and I love views, but you know, if I, if you don't like me, turn it off, okay? And, um, oh God, you see this line? I gotta get going. All right, so let's come this through. Can you see how there's like a line of dark hair? It's looking pretty hot, okay. So, um, as far as people saying that, it kind of sucks, but then, I mean, I get why they say it, because, well, they don't, you know, they're selling limelight and some of my reviews are negative, so, you know. I guess if I was still in limelight, I would be jumping on people too. Um, and then just remember, limelight people can't say anything negative about the con their company. And like, there's always something negative to be said about things. That was one of the reasons why I didn't do it. So anyway, let's just quickly get through this because holy shit. Um, I'm trying to pull some of this through the rest of my hair. And... Um, 
whatever happens, this will look different than it did when I started. And I'm not seeing any orange, so that, that's good. Let's just quickly go through, make sure there's like no more orange. I see orange down here. Um, I'm seeing some brown being pulled through. I don't see much more problems. Okay, I'm going to clean up my tub from the towels my husband threw in there because he had a spill and then like threw the towels in the tub like I, I have to clean them now. Somebody has to clean them. So it's me, right? He couldn't pick them up and put them in the washer right I guess. Ooh, that's my job. All right, so I'm going to clean up the towels so I can rinse my head in the tub because I don't feel like taking a shower. I just took a shower. See you soon. All right, so this is the after. Um, still under renovation, you know, stuff going on everywhere. But uh, I am so pleased because it is no longer orange. I don't really love it, but this is the completion of my eternal quest for ashy blonde hair for now, for the spring. I'll be back for my summer update soon. <laughs> but for now, this is it. I'm glad the roots aren't bad, you can see. And I'll do two more things for you to show you how it turned out. I'm gonna go back into the bathroom to show you under that light. And then I'll take you outside and then we're done. And you've seen what has happened, what transpired this spring with my uh, adventures and DIY hair. All right, let's run to the bathroom. Okay. Here is me under the harsh light of my bathroom. You can see most of the orange is gone. There's still a little tiny bit, but it's, it is so much better than it was. Um, I can't even tell you how much I love it compared to the way it was. I had actually hoped it would end up being, you know, more dark brown, but Orange is gone, all is good. Let's go outside. Okay, we are outside on an overcast day and you can see my hair. I am pretty pleased it is not so orange anymore and it is just perfect for me. All right, that's end of my video. Thanks for watching Melanie Mills Toasted Blonde. Subscribe to my channel, bye.